Hey, what's up, guys? It's Coach Todd from NC Fit Club, and today is day three of the asylum back to core. So uh, here we go. Ten more seconds here. You work through. You concentrate. You strengthen that back. Every athlete needs a good back. In three, two, one. Right to the top of the boots. That's what this is about. This is about working your whole back. And you see this move. At this moment, you don't need the chin up bar, but this is going to get you ready for the chin up bar. Keep going. Keep pushing. How you feel, Amari? 20 seconds left. I'm right here with you. Everybody start to get those knees down. Don't cheat. Don't cheat. Get those knees down. Look back toward those fingertips. Feel the burn. Without the burn, it don't mean nothing. Come on. Mike, get that knee down. Come on, go. You at home. You work. You get that knee down. You better be in the right position. Come on. Three, two, one. Shake it out. Shake out your arms. Shake out your arms. You know the only sweat is that you have. I want to hear you breathing. That means you're working. That's right. Keep moving. Keep going. Lift, lift. Now, this move is going to help you in game day when you're doing swim, when you're doing that 100 meter threshold. This is your practice for that. This is what you got to do if you want to get better at that move. Come on, come on. Keep those arms straight. Keep those arms straight. You got 10 seconds left. Get that chest off the floor. Get it up. Get those quadriceps up. Get those toes off the floor. You go. You push. Work that back. Three, two. Good job. Go on the child's pose. Awesome job. All right, now. Come on. Get in there. See how she lifts up when she comes through. Lift it up. And those elbows stay into the side. You feel that? Keep going. Keep going. You can do it. You can do it. Keep working. That's what I'm talking about. That's what I'm talking about. Time going to child's pose. What's up, guys? Uh, workout's done. It was back to core. This was day three of the asylum. And uh, a couple of things I want to tell you about this workout. Number one, I think it's probably, for those of you that have done P90X, imagine the legs and back and an ab ripper X combined into one. I don't think I've ever done a workout that worked my back as much as this. I mean, the moves, the core moves, the principles and the science behind it. He's talking about working your the back of your core and your back muscles to help your core out. And, and some of the moves, your quads and your legs and your calves and your hamstrings are on fire. And I mean, you're in a flop sweat and you're not, you know, it's, it's you're sweating because like in yoga when you're holding these poses, you're doing stuff that makes you hurt and you're so uncomfortable, but it's awesome. because you can. And, and I love the way he talks to you in this workout, and he's telling you, is your mind stronger than what your body's telling you, and you have to push through it, and you want to drop out of the poses, but you don't, or at least you try not to. And, uh, I mean, it was intense, but it was, it was good. It was, it was, it was one of the, the best, I think it's the best back workout I've ever done. My entire back is sore. I mean, I can feel it in my traps and, I mean, everywhere. My shoulder blades, everything hurts. My delts, I mean, just everything is just, it was a good workout. All right, see you guys tomorrow.